What's going on, guys? And welcome back to some more Super Mario RPG. In the last part, we uh, basically defeated Johnny Jones, got the star, only for us to get stolen from the uh, people that claim to be townspeople. Let's go see what's up with them. Anyway, so I probably should have swapped out my party members. The blaze late was taking so long. We need to get out of here. This is just great. Mario caught up with us. Only one thing we can do now, although we may rush a little, we have to swim for it. Not so fast there. The star is a gift to me, mate Mario. Your spineless dogs have no code of honor. We'll make you walk the plank. Johnny, maybe we should leave Mario to the pleasure of walking things up here. Hee <laughs> hee, I guess I'll have to take care of our disguises off now. Group formation! Anyway, so I do have the right party members. So I have Mallow out for a reason, but anyway, we're gonna Geno boost Mario. Now, I did it wrong. Yeah. That's like one of the few times I've ever failed a Geno boost when I'm out on like recording for a reason, but um. Yeah, I strongly recommend using the princess for this fight, so we're gonna swap out Mallow for her and uh. Unfortunately, I have to Geno boost Mario a second time so I can get the defense up. And my Alexa is whatever. So, I don't know why I slapped her, but I don't know. I guess it was in Water Blast, so, um, yeah, and, uh, and that didn't even last damage despite, uh, Geno boost. Okay. Geno boost. Geno boost yourself. I'm, I haven't been very good at keeping the gauge up for whatever reason, but uh, we're just gonna group. I, I strongly just recommend using the princess for this battle. 234 damage. I, I again, like, what is up with my timing? I I haven't set the game most. So there's no input lag. Uh, uh let's just uh, let's just slap her. Mario can take it. Mario can absorb the damage. 158 damage and Mirage attack. Now, this is an interesting attack because, like, uh, he's gonna clone himself and whatever's taking the normal damage is the real one. So, um, yeah, that's the real one. So, 150 damage. The fake one will take more damage, but, uh, it will not count as, uh, for attack for whatever reason. I feel like it's just a Mirage, so, uh, and also double the attack. I think you should also be almost down. 126. And Gino, you probably should finish him off. And that finished him off. This can be a tough boss if you go unprepared. Just, just FYI. And we got a couple of level ups, so, uh, yeah, so, uh, Gino's level 12, and again, we'll go physical. And Prince, and Peach is level 12, so we'll go, uh, HP. Anyway, so we got the star. Smithy's now in the race of the star pieces. What horrible surprise we must be having the star from Mario. Now, there's a, we can leave Rose Town. Actually, we got the shed key. We have to free the townspeople first because they got kidnapped. Phew, thanks so much. I've had enough of cramped dirty old places like this. Hey, fella, you guys have a bind. Peace, brother. I was mighty unpleasant here. Thank you for helping us out. Thank you, yeah, thanks a lot. Be sure to stop by. Yeah, stop on by. Thank you for freeing us. Got back to work now, but stop by the end. See you there. Ah, Mario. Thank you for saving the little town of Seaside. Big town's people gave us a to save us. Please take this as our thanks. We got the flower box. So I guess we can use that. And Peaches. I'm so relieved that the town's people were all right in the end. 
Can you believe he just didn't kidnap them? He turned there and walk out too? Me and my man would never pull a stunt like that. Look at that, Peach. She's like, really? I seem to recall saying someone kidnapping me not too long ago. The scene was added in the remake. I like how they added that. Ugh, now I got hurt. I saw that. Was I like how this game, like, I always like how this game basically, like, pokes fun at some aspects of the Mario series. So, really, you're like any of the Mario RPGs. Uh, this one, this game in particular. But, uh, there's a cup. There's a few more things I want to buy in Rose Town. First of all, we can go to the shops and they'll sell something. So, we're going to buy the paratrooper shell. It doesn't raise Mario's attack, but I just want to show it off. So we'll buy um, we'll buy the ribbit stick from Mallow. We'll buy the fink, not the finger shot. We don't want to buy the finger shot. We already have that. However, we want to buy the double punch because that attacks the jeep. That and let's buy um, let's buy the parasol for Peach. And that's going to be it for weapons. However, armor. And uh, let's see. Let's buy. Uh, I think I'll hold off buying the sailor shirt, but we'll buy the sailor pants from. Actually, no, we. No, we don't have- we already have these items. Yeah, so, uh... I don't want to go here, but this will be something for later. But, uh, there's actually one last thing I want to do in Seaside Town. So if we go over here... Hello there, you're Mario, right? Do you remember the movie Rat Tap of when I saw the tap I've graduated from this frog stage school and now I'm searching for the meaning of life. It was really quiet around here until a little while ago. What happened? I don't know. Do you have any frog coins? I want to buy the XP booster. We're going to give that to... Why don't we give it to Mario? So basically, the XP booster is it doubles the XP for the specific character. So, um... I'll swap it around, but uh, let's just say... I strongly recommend getting the XP booster because it'll speed up the level up process. I actually wanted to go to the uh, elder right here. Mario, if it's a star you look for, I may be able to help you. If the far side lands on a time from reform monsters, a mouse came by the end, and I overheard them boasting about a star of theirs. I don't know exactly where the town's looking for, follow the road, you'll get there. That's where we have to go next. Not actually access lands on except as you talk to him, but however, if we want to, we want to go to, uh, Actually, I want to do something first. This just reminded me. We could have done this earlier, but I want to go back to Booster Tower. If we go back there. Hey, remember this guy? This knife guy. He, I'm really sorry about before. He'll make up for you. He, huh? Are we having fun yet? He, he, he. Oh, this is just fine. It sounds for real. You have to. All right. So we're, we have to pay attention for the yellow balls. Guess what? And the other So watch carefully. Right hand at Wiltrum. We gotta do this like I think three times. Play sure. And the watch where the yellow ball is, it's in the left hand. I think if you do this three times, I think it's three times. I think it's three times in a row. It's right hand. Is it three times? It's actually it's ten times, I think. Left hand. He's gonna say like a certain piece of dialogue, but um. All right, so ten times in a row we got the bright card. So uh, this allows him to go into his brother's casino. This is kind of a side quest for later, but it's ten times actually total. But um, that's pretty neat. Hey, what am I talking about? I just go straight. I can just go straight to a uh, seaside town. But uh, if you got, we got like a lot of rotten mush and moldy mush. But that's there's also kind of a side, another side quest we can do. I think um, if we go here, that's your shop. So all right. So um, actually, this is not what I was thinking of. I guess they ch did they change it from the original game. I guess we can buy Zoom shoes, so yeah, let's buy one. Let's buy one. Let's buy one for Bowser, because he needs. He's a slow character. Let's buy one for Mallow. Hey, I guess I made a new discovery. So where is that place I'm looking for? It's this. It's this place. Hmm. 
In the original game, there was a place uh, you could put you could put the moldy mushrooms in. Maybe it's oh, it's it's this guy. If we have uh, any mushrooms. Mushrooms. So yeah, that was uh, basically the guy. So I don't know. I guess I made a new discovery. So I guess we can. I guess we can go to Land's End, but um, I think now is an appropriate time to cut it off for this part of Super Mario RPG. So. Next time I assume my RPG, we'll go look for the stars in a far end. See you guys then.